happy birthday as well. You always find the latest courtyard. Even in solution. In out of the box. Hello and welcome to Radio Waves by Totterbert. If you enjoy reviews, comparisons, band scans of new and classic portable radios, then make sure to subscribe and tap the bell icon so don't miss any of my most awesome videos. In front of us, we have a legendary General Electric Super Radio, the original, and I'm going to form a daytime AM band scan. We'll go over features of the radio, we'll do a size comparison, and we'll start cruising the daytime band. So let's check it out. The GE Super Radio came from the late 70s, spouts a 200 millimeter internal ferret antenna for some great AM reception. Gotta love it. You got this monster, I think it's a five and a half, six inch speaker here. Yeah, just amazing. Sounds good. It's mellow. I prefer the original Super Radio over Super Radio 2. The 2 version had the tweeter here and it had more of a full range uh, center speaker. So it had a lot of highs. I'm a fan of the mellow lows on this radio, so let's check out some features. All right, left hand side. Just got some design elements. Okay, nice. Front, we have our dial. You can see it says long range. FM on top there, 88 to 108. Our log scale in the middle and our AM band there going to 1620, but I think it goes a little higher. We'll test that today. It says high sensitivity too. Sweet. Um, power switch on top there, tuning knob. Of course, I showed you the speaker behind the metal speaker grill. This uh, radio came in decent shape. I want to say I paid about 45 or 50 bucks for it. Um, that's what they're selling for on eBay. Uh, you can check the links below. Uh, if you like supporting the channel and pick up one of these monster radios, be my guest. It's probably the most affordable analog DX machine on AM you're going to find. FM, it's fairly decent, but it really shines on AM. Uh, yeah, metal speaker grill, General Electric tag here, our monster speaker. Um, yeah, tuning knob. Our switches here, if you look here, this is the uh, band select. We have FM and AM. Simple little chrome slider. I like that. Uh, you have AFC, uh, automatic frequency control for FM. And you can go on or off. I usually have that on off. We have treble control, bass control, and of course, loudness, which is our volume control. Right hand side of the radio. Do we have anything? It looks like we do. It says earphone. Probably single ear only. I haven't tested that. I usually don't on the old radios just to be safe. <laughs> uh, top, we have a really cool handle. It's all metal with some plastic treatments. Um, I like that. I think it's all metal. Hold on a second. Let me look at this again. Okay, so it's, a, I think, a plastic middle with metal ends. That's what it is. Okay, yeah. Solid metal ends, but they put a plastic center. Now, this thing's held up for all these years. I don't think we'll run into any trouble. We got our FM antenna. Of course, it pops up here, spins around, goes down. Over the ages, it doesn't want to go all the way in, so I'm not going to mess with it. It's fine. It works. Back of the radio, we have some antenna hookups, which is nice. Uh, let's see. So right over here, yeah. So if you look closely, you'll see it says FM, and then you have an AM. So you have your FM for dipole, and then you have your antenna ground for uh, your uh, AM band. Pretty nice. If you look there, it says 200 millimeter uh Ferrite, let's see, was that rod antenna it says? Yeah, cool. Um, so that's his claim to fame for the internal. And then here we have the GE and the model number. If I get that into focus there. I can only raise this so much before it hits the camera because it's a fairly big radio, but there's your model number there. Uh, behind this battery compartment is six D cell batteries. Check it out. And then it also has an AC cord bundled in here. I love that. So I, I was running this thing off AC for quite a while. Then I gave this radio a break. I've been using my EP Pro all the time. But uh, I wouldn't mind plugging this back in and listening to it. But there you go, your AC cord attached to the radio permanently. And, of course, our six D-cell batteries. Now, if you hear some creaking sounds, it's this battery compartment. <laughs> there you go. So, okay, let's do a little quick size comparison. Then we'll turn this on. Now, it's been two years since I did a band scan with this. So I figured, what the heck? There's a lot of new viewers and subscribers on my channel, and they may miss that video. And they may be looking for a classic radio that's you know, vintage, analog, and is a beast. And this is it. Um, you don't have to buy the RF2200. You know, it's the Panasonic, which is a claim to fame for medium wave. It is an amazing receiver. You can get yourself one of these for like 50, 60 bucks and be happy. You don't have to spend the two, $300 to get that high end. You can be happy with just this. So let's go ahead and show you a little size comparison. CC pocket in the house. There you go. We have 
So you see Skywave in case I get lost in the dial, but I don't think I will because if I remember correctly, this dial is one of the most accurate analog dials I own, bar none, except for the Panasonic RF2200. Its dial is also amazing. Uh, so that's Skywave, and of course we have Iron Man. He's the man with the master plan. He loves big speakers all day long, man. <laughs> Anyway, you could, yeah, you know, I can never think of new things on the fly. I just try. <laughs> hey, that rhymed. <laughs> but you get the idea. Deck of cards, boom. Okay, so let's go ahead uh, and turn this on. Here we can hear in the daytime band. Now, you'll see me turning the radio because uh, I don't have a turn style. And you have to turn your radio uh, on the AM band to receive the signals. It uses that internal antenna. It's uh, horizontally mounted, and you have to face that horizontal edge towards the station you're trying to receive. So if there's a faint station, you turn the radio towards that station and you'll pick it up better. A lot of people know that, a lot of people don't know that, so that's why I brought it to your attention. So let's go ahead, we're at the bottom of the band here. Power switch is on top. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and turn it on. A little snap there. That's normal, um, not worried about it. We'll turn it up. I think all my noise makers are off. Okay, start going. Now I might lift this up so you can see once in a while what the dial says. It's just the angle of my camera. So right here's a station. This is 540 WAUK Jackson, Wisconsin. Now when I turn the radio, I'm going to face it that way. Technically that is to the south, but it doesn't matter what the horizontal antenna, either the front edge or the back edge is fine. I'm receiving the signal. So I'm going to point it toward the top of this radio towards the south. We'll still pick up the north station. See, and it came into tune. Did you know the arrow in Amazon's logo? So this is yeah, Jackson, Wisconsin, which is north. Logo should represent unemployed. There's your dial. You can read that there. Brian was out of work when he started classes in March. In right, let's keep tuning. His IT career working for Amazon. Out of volume. Just want to say it hurts me more than the squeeze. Here's 560 to be IND, Chicago, Illinois. The answer. Actual, uh, punishing, Let's but the, point the, it to the, Chicago. The sound effects are painful. Okay. All right, we'll be back in a moment. Base. You are listening to the Dennis Prager Show, and we'll go to Gary and Tim. Full trouble, full base. No base, full trouble. Your life. Streaming at 560theanswer.com on the AM560 so, app on your Alexa minimal Art trouble, speaker. minimal bass. Let's then do a little bit of bass. Five degrees at a trouble. On AM560, the answer. Good morning. I'm Mike Scott. A man okay, let's is keep in going. Custody after a report of a suspicious vehicle in front of Counseling help to get out of this relationship, and and basically she was just you know. Here's 580 WILL Urbana Illinois. It's about 150 miles south. Uh, why are you? Why have you been in this relationship for so long, and not really getting um, you know help and and steps of getting out of the relationship, uh, not being directed towards counseling or anything like that, and so she just felt kind of helpless and and um. And after that encounter with... ...to make a difference in a proud partner in going pink for a purpose. And Bronson Cancer Center, Kalamazoo, providing the very highest care, diagnosis... Okay, I heard Kalamazoo. This is uh, Michigan. Uh, this is 590 WKZO. And this is about 140 miles away. And now, current time, and I've caught that in my pocket. Whoops. Bumping the tripod. 11.28 a.m. Central Daylight Time near Chicago, Illinois, USA. Uh, we're pretty close to midday, so let me see here. I'm going to bring in a Turk Advantage. I don't think it'll affect this radio too much sometimes. These big radios with big antennas aren't affected by passive loops, but I'm going to try. This is the Turk Advantage. Passive loop you can pick up. It's a premium. works really well. Uh, if you're a medium wave listener or AM listener, you're going to want one of these, especially if you listen to a lot of portable radio. Uh, also, if you have a home stereo, you can hook this up to your home stereo, too. Let's go ahead and... It helps a little bit. There we go. 
Put that off the table, on the chair below. But let's be clear, the internet itself did not fail. Somehow, all of Facebook's DNS routing information... Here's 600, uh, this is WMT, Cedar Rapids, Iowa, 175 miles away now. Let's look at that dial, it should be pretty dead accurate. Yeah, I would say it's, it's right on the money. If you can see, it's right between 6 and 0. Awesome. This is a great radio, guys. If you haven't noticed, I love this radio. <laughs> Again, did some band scans two years ago, and I figured, you know, it's time. My wife and I love the Fox and Hounds restaurant. The food is world class, and your second dinner is always free. WTMJ's John Mercure here. Some of the most stunning... 620 WTMJ, Milwaukee, Wisconsin. And it's not even pointed to Milwaukee. Milwaukee's that way. It'll improve if I turn it, but it's a beast. I'm not going to turn it. You guys can hear it. <laughs> Fresh salmon and salads, even the steak and lobster. Your second dinner's free tonight. The Fox and Hounds... <laughs> We got uh, Hispanic music on WMFN, Piatone, Illinois, 6.40 a.m. Now, I usually have to point it that direction to get a good signal. Let's see if I can do that. Let's turn it. And, uh, yeah, I mean, it's music. You got to see what it sounds like. There we go. Can't hover on it, believe it or not. managed to screw this thing up one more time on the on the exit with Sam Darnold and I think it seems to me anyway that would have been a more plausible way to go would have been to keep Darnold and then racked up perhaps three first round picks in exchange so if you like a lot of bass just turn that bass up if you like a little bit more trouble I kind of like a little bit more trouble a little less bass that's me positions to succeed and that's been something he's it's done easier on my ears uh, 670 the score to be SCR Chicago home of the Cubs there's that better system, right? But also just getting away from Adam Gase also has its own benefits for every single player. And so, you know, the Jets could have looked at it and gone, man, all right, we totally screwed up with Gase. But This might be an interesting thing. Let's see if this is anything important. Let me tune it in. Seven hundred WLW. Don't quote me on that. Uh, it's three hundred miles away. That's why I'm taking my time to try to find this one. Clouded with a forty percent chance for showers and thunder. Yes, that was. So we just heard a station three hundred miles away during the day. Beautiful. UGN Dow is up just a little more than 1%, 34,391. S&P 500 up about the same at 4,350. Your 720 WGN Chicago. Half percent. It's at 14,469. We're at 65 degrees at O'Hare. renewal conditioner the color safe formula with 780 wbbm chicago old time radio monday through fridays between 12 a.m and 1 a.m central daylight time or central standard time depending on what month it is <laughs> um it's pretty neat if you guys can tune in chicago from where your location uh definitely tune in 780 uh, and enjoy some old time radio they have a whole hour of it every day monday through friday 
It's nice. You post on ZipRecruiter, get a quality candidate within the first day. And 82% of you will remember that you can try ZipRecruiter for free. But you have to go to ZipRecruiter.com slash free. Yes, free. One accurate dial for sure. I didn't have to touch anything. It's nice. Amco Transmissions and Total Car Care has been serving Chicago... Zuckerberg. Oh, okay, so he figured out a way to make money off of that program. Right. Okay, and yeah, that's the way the algorithm works. So now that you know that, be careful of the information that you leave. Yeah. Also, the government already started tracking you when you were born because that was your social security number. Get over it, people. I had to measure it. I'm going to have to find out the advertised uh, speaker, and I'll put it here. How big that is. I thought it was either five and a half inches or six inches advertised. Uh, vis visuals, five inches. But you know the flanges, they go by the flange diameter, I believe, across the longest point. Uh, so, yeah, I, I want to say it's like five and a half to six inch. I'll put it there. <laughs> Social media site. So, yesterday, 20 to be CPT, Willow Springs, Illinois, a left wing station. I think it's the only one on the whole band where I live seeing things that get posted in the order in which they get posted. Uh, if you post on other right. social media sites, particularly Facebook. See, if you listen closely, sometimes you hear a signal. It'll be like, you know something's there. So turn the radio and see if you can hear it. Let's turn it. There it is. We got a music station in Milwaukee, Wisconsin. It's a uh, eight. Um, let's see, where is this? Eight sixty. Don't quote me on that. It's been a bit here. <laughs> um, this is uh, WNOV, uh, fifty-two miles away. But the cool thing is, it's four hundred watts. That is pretty amazing. I like that. I'm just looking at my paperwork to see if I have written down. Yeah, the eight sixty. Okay. I'm used to saying uh, CJBC at night. <laughs> All right. Cool. Pointing it to the east or the west, sometimes we can pick up 870 WKAR East Lansing, Michigan, about 200 miles away. It might be difficult today. There it is. Keep going. That's cool. We found that. Again on the show today, but there are leftists listening who are just hearing this for the first time. Here's 890 WLS, Chicago, Illinois. The Fauci types out there that you gotta get a vaccine no matter what. Natural immunity. Ha <laughs> ha. We don't know what that. Never heard of that stuff. Uh, that was a huge game for the Chargers, who have kind of blown a game against Dallas. The Big Badger, 920 WOKY, Milwaukee. Dialed in, getting and then he rallies, we'll go a little quicker here. He said, first look for the kingdom of God. In other words, holiness of life. 930 WBKM, Relevant Radio, Sandwich, Illinois. Tomorrow, you only have the grace of today's troubles. Yeah. Got music there, 940 WFAW, Fort Atkinson, Wisconsin. It's all about Jesus Christ. Um, uh, uh, this whole spirit of Here's 950 WNTD, Chicago, Illinois. Well, uh, let's let's go to the phones really quick. Okay. It would be fun. I, I've got another, uh, there's another fellow who does uh, voicing, and I wanted to do a show. May have to clean that loudness uh, pot. Okay. This is uh, 1000 WMVP, Chicago. Oh, excuse me. No, it's not. It's 970 uh, WHA, Madison, Wisconsin. If I lift this up, it should be 970. Oop. Yeah, see, it's a big radio bumping into things. Yeah, you can see the dial there. It's just shy of 1000. And then we'll be right on the money here in a moment, M1000. Yeah, it's a big radio. Right. On the bikes. And David Lee. 
Hopefully, Bill Lazer's got a little bit more. Yeah, hey, it, you true. guys won this week against the Lions. Yeah. 1,000 WMVP Chicago. Yeah. Malcolm Brown is somebody to keep an eye on. You probably got to grab him this week. <laughs> 10.30 WNVR, Vernon Hills, Illinois. Like I said, I'm going to speed it up. Here's 10.50 WLIP, Kenosha, Wisconsin. That's interesting. The music is 1060 WHFB, Benton Harbor, Michigan, which is 100 miles away. I don't tend to pick that up too well, but I'm going to zoom in on this. Motown and more. Cool. <laughs> we got the call letters there, WHFB. Nice. Well, it might be one of the first times I've gotten that on this G. It's a non-conference game. You can get away with sitting for this one. How about this, Karen? Front Office Sports just tweeted, the NFLPA has named its first... 1070 NFL WTSO, Madison, Wisconsin. A minute to go. Want to take a guess? Is it a current player? No, retired player. Chief This is a... Uh, 1080 WNWI, Oakland, Illinois. Here's 1110 WNBI, Chicago. Track the numbers they want to use for the policies they insist. Here's 1130 WISN, Milwaukee, Wisconsin. Here's what I would say. We have a ton of people in media who listen to this show. Vision roared to life. Friends, when we get in trouble, the first thing we ought to do is turn... 1160 WYLL, Hope for Your Life, Christian Radio on... Uh, yeah, is it 1160? This is Chicago, Illinois. Rather than trying all of our own devices to make it happen, they each cried to their I'm own God. They threw the turn this to the get the squirrel. Gotta point this direction. Oh yeah, we got the squirrel on WSQR, Sycamore, Illinois. Squirrels are in your neighborhood. Nice. WRTO 1200, Chicago, Illinois. Hispanic programming. <laughs> Somebody's pouring something. 1220 WKRS, Waukegan, Illinois. Sexual legacy photo session with your dog or pet. Tom Edwards does an amazing. Twelve thirty to be CLO, Janesville, Wisconsin. Camera Wisconsin Photography in Janesville. View his photo gallery and book your shoot today at abcamerawisconsin.com. It's been tough talking to my doctor about. That sounds good, right? Um, that's WSBC on 1240, Chicago, Illinois. This paint station is always hard to get. 1260 WEKZ, Monroe, Wisconsin, about 60 miles away. I think it's low wattage or the antennas aren't pointed my way. They know their wheat berry daily from their whole grain breads. Baked on site from... 1280 WBIG, Aurora, Illinois. Located in Naperville Plaza. At the corner. It's 1290. This is WZTI, Greenfield, Wisconsin. LaFonz, Radio 1290. 
jakiś inny sposób z internetu korzystają. Jeszcze coś 12 godzin dziennie przygląda się tylko i wyłącznie posty i historycy na Facebooku czy na Instagramie, no to co wtedy tam... <laughs> Rock and back and forth. Uh, WRDZ LaGrange, Illinois on 1300. Let's see what that scale looks like. I would say it looks pretty good. Benefits, features, or devices vary by plan and area. Limitations and exclusions. 1310 WIBA, Madison, Wisconsin. Network providers. Network size varies by plan and by market. Wealth is about more than making money. It's about making the most. Here's 1330 WNTA, Rockford, Illinois. Uh, I swear to God, the last two times I've been unable to show up for a Monday. Single sheet of notebook paper. Christina's bucket list. I mean, what kid writes a bucket list? 1360 WLBK, DeKalb, Illinois. Christina probably wrote it in high school. Can you read some of what's... We got some music here on 1380 WBEL, South Beloit, Illinois. Sounds good. Clinical trials discover new treatments when people participate. That bass down with the talker. Uh, 1390 WGRB. Um, it's got, uh, what do we call it, uh, religious programming. Uh, Chicago, Illinois. It's gospel music, typically. You could bubble wrap it. Diane Alexander's injured shoulder. Alexander was knocked out of Sunday. 1400 WRJ and Racine, Wisconsin. Got him speeded up here. Coach Matt Lafleur has said that he won't know. 1310. Area code 847-931-1410. Good selectivity. 1410 WRMN, Elgin, Illinois. Shopping radio. 1410.com. And now, back to the radio shopping show. Good morning, good morning. This is Tori with your radio shopping show broadcast. You gotta sell a radio, Tori. Sell a radio on the radio, and I'll buy it. Maybe this will go viral. Maybe they'll say, hey, Totterbird just reviewed us, or band scanned us, or whatever you want to call it. <laughs> and he wants a radio on the radio. Almost in a way, kind of pay it forward. Now, keep in mind that when it comes to the radio shopping show, um, it's a great tool. It's something that we've offered to you guys multiple times this on multiple so occasions cool. throughout the years for <laughs> decades at this point to get you guys deals and savings on so many different items and different merchandise. <laughs> Okay, so we picked up 1420 there. I'm trying to tell my daytime list. This right here is 1430 WEEF, Deerfield, Illinois. I'm going to look at my nighttime list here on 1420. And I think that was uh, Davenport, Iowa, WOC. Um, and it's 131 miles away. Uh, daytime, uh, I'm not sure what their wattage is, but that was pretty cool. So we can pick that back up. Yeah, that might be Josh. Yeah, right here. Nice. Back to 1430. Running out of time. 1440 WROK, Rockford, Illinois. Let's breathe. Uh, WCEV or something else now, I believe. 1450 Cicero, Illinois. Probably 1460. Probably 1470. Contact Dawn and Zach Travel at 608 247 3833. 1490 Iron Country, WGEZ, Beloit, Wisconsin. 1500 WPJX, Zion, Illinois. Heavy metal on the AM band. Cool. 
cool classic music on 1520 WLUV Loves Park, Illinois. Nice. Fifteen sixty WGLB, Port Washington, Wisconsin. I think that might have been something else. Country music here might this might be fifteen sixty WGLB. Excuse me, that was fifteen eighty WTTN, Watertown, Wisconsin. That's country music before. This is 1590 WCGO. Wait a minute. No, this is not. This is WTTN. Wow, I'm finding everything here. That might have been 1570 also with that music. Um, yeah, it was. The country music was WFRL, 1570 Freeport, Illinois, 60 miles away, 5,000 watts. Man, a lot of stations here at the end. Yeah, that's 1570. 1580. WTTN. Watertown, Wisconsin. 1590. I should have known better. <laughs> it's got uh, the Asian programming, WCGO, Evanston, Illinois. Traffic Advisor Radio on 1620. You're almost done. Okay, some music. 1630, Mighty, mighty uh, KCJJ, Iowa City, Iowa. And uh, yeah, that's a good little distance of 175 miles away, 10,000 watts during the day. Um, moved by the goodness of Jesus and the... 1640 WSJP Sussex, Wisconsin. Catholic Radio. That's where it tops out. Okay, cool. We're done. <laughs> Glad you enjoyed the video. Like, comment, subscribe. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty simple. Uh, go buy yourself one. Use links below. Rock on. Like this video. Um, you know, if you like GE radios, you like super radios, subscribe, bell icon, and three, of course, comment on what you think about the SR1 is the one you'd want. Okay, guys, take care, and we'll see you in my next video.